um, welcome to my 12 week pregnancy vlog. Um, I'm in a different location right now because it got too dark in the other room. Um, and it's really cold outside so I put a jacket on um, and I'm getting laughed at <laughs> because my friend who's filming me says, she's like, what are you wearing? I actually don't know what I'm wearing. I'm wearing a, not sure what this is. It's got food stain on it. And then my skirt here is from my mom. I raided my mom's closet. Don't ask me why. Um, so yeah, so I'm a little I'm dressed unconventionally, but that's okay. Um, so this week has been amazing. It's been so good. Um, I am 12 weeks. Okay. My days are Tuesday. So today is Saturday. Oh God. Okay. So I'm 12 weeks Tuesday. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. <laughs> Why did I do that? Saturday. Um, 12 weeks, four days. So I'm pretty like into my 12th week. And it was awesome because yesterday I got to finally announce my pregnancy on social media. If any of you saw it, thank you so much. The comments were amazing. Um, I cried. I put I put up the post like we put, Mark and I planned it out where I was going to post it and then he was going to post one straight away. Um, and we're at, sitting in Cafe Gratitude, one of my favorite restaurants. And I posted it and I just started crying in front of like all my friends at Cafe Gratitude because I know everyone who works there. And it was so embarrassing, but it was like just a, like a culmination of so many things. It was like the whole... Oh, I see you. You, you do the Auntie Butt is helping mummy film right now. You want to come be in the video? No, no, no worries. Um, it was, you know, the process of getting pregnant was a long process for us because I was breastfeeding and I, as you know, as I've said, I, oh, there's no water left. Should we ask daddy for some water? Yeah, open the door and ask daddy for a refill. Um, he's feeding the plants. Yeah, so it was just like the last 14 months and the desire to get pregnant and finally being able to announce it and not hide it from anyone and being like free to wear whatever I want to wear because we had been getting uh, photographed and I was like constantly trying to hide my belly until we announced it so it was really refreshing and it was like such a beautiful relief to like finally put it out there and it made it feel almost even more real um, and so that was really beautiful um, and I just like was so moved by the messages and just how genuinely happy people were for our family and um, it just made me so emotional and it was really such a sweet thing to be able to do and, um, and I loved it and then you know sure enough I got tons of emails from friends who had seen like media stuff about it and um, and it was just really lovely. And then also this week I went to my, I go to this um, once a month uh, like spiritual mama's group. Oh my ears. Um, that like made a really weird scrapey noise, whatever he's doing over there. Um, I went to my group and I was lying down because I was so tired. I'd had my son Isaac's, my stepson's eight um, year old birthday party that day. And it was just me and his mum and all these kids. So it was literally like me and Frankie holding it down with a bunch of eight-year-old boys. And I was so exhausted. That was all day long. And then I went straight to this like spiritual mama's group. And it goes for like three hours and everyone talks about stuff going on with them. I was like slowly like falling asleep. And like just going lower and lower to the ground and everyone because they know I'm pregnant were like come and sit on the couch I was like no no I'm fine I prefer to just sit here in the lotus position but I started like really kind of rocking off to the side and then I swear to god I felt like a little boop, boop on the inside of my belly and I just here's the thing I know I'm only 12 and a half weeks so it's pretty much impossible but it felt so similar to how it felt when I first felt Bodhi when I was 17 weeks along. Um, and it was really sweet. And I was like, what? I mean, could have definitely been just like an air bubble in there. Um, but from watching the sonogram, 
he is moving so much. Like he's literally like, whoa, whoa, whoa. He's the most active baby, way more active than what I remember Bodhi being. I um, mean, I actually compared the videos and um, oh, I was about to say his name, whoops. Um, and baby in the belly um, just seems way more just active and um, I don't know what that's about. Uh, so maybe I did feel him, maybe I didn't. Yeah, my lovey? It's cold out here. It is cold out here. Lucky you've got your jumper on so you're nice and warm. Um, it is really cold out here, hence why I'm wearing this strange thing. Um, okay, this week I weigh 121. So I've put on a pound. Oh no, two pounds this week. Um, I feel like my belly is just so large now. And um, I actually went with my friend Cassandra, who's filming. She's the manager of Your Zen Life. Um, we went wedding dress shopping because it's her wedding. And <laughs> the woman, <laughs> what the woman said to me when I when I got in there, we were like trying on dresses for Cassandra. P.S. We tried on like a size 16, so it didn't fit her at all. And I was making jokes about how like, oh, it would fit me because of my belly. And she, and she was like, how far along are you? And I said, oh, I'm three months. And she was like, what? Like she didn't believe that I was three months. She was like, no, you look a lot, a lot further along. You look a lot bigger, more like six or seven months. I was like, oh, thank you so much. Oh my gosh, thank you. <laughs> it, was so, it was so funny. And I was like, I hear you. I mean, I really look way more pregnant than I actually am. And even in some of the media reports that we've seen, it's like, she's due in October. She must be due in August. I'm like, oh gosh, how embarrassing. I'm due at the end of November. Um, so that was really funny and, um, but also at the same time it was like validating because I keep trying to say to Mark, like, I'm really showing so much more this time. I don't think he really remembers. And it's like, no, you look about the normal size. I'm like, no, for real, I look way more pregnant than I am. Um, and he is actually measuring a week and a half ahead. Not that that really matters, but Bodhi always measured a week and a half ahead and he came eight days early, so we'll see. Um, no other weird cravings, food's been great, feel totally normal, still sleeping on my tummy. Um, been sleeping great. Oh, I'm traveling tomorrow. Economy class for Australia with two kids and my husband. Awesome. Um, not super psyched about that. But we bought, I bought a bunch of pillow pets. You know, those little pillows that are like pets. Anyway, so I'm going to sleep on one of them. I hope I'm going to get some sleep. If not, I'm probably going to need a week to get over the flight. Um, but it's cool. We're going to be in Australia, get to meet the midwife, um, get our house in Australia already because that's where we will be birthing. So we'll be bringing our new son home to, to our house in Adelaide and that's going to be fantastic. And so we're getting all renovated and, um, I'm really looking forward to it. So lots of big travels. Um, but I'll still obviously keep updating you It'll just be from Australia. So let me show you my belly, even though it's so freezing. Um, your cute little finger. That's right. <laughs> um, okay, don't mind my mum's skirt. Like, I have all her stuff at my house because we moved her out of her apartment here. Anyway, um, okay. Here's the belly. Isn't that ginormous? Like, I'm literally like, wow, this is a big baby. Um, and it's really cool. I love it because I feel so pregnant. Um, so that's the front on. Oh, my lovey. Are you building a fire? Um, so that's it. All right, guys. I will see you next week um, at my 13 weeks. And then I'll be up to date because I'll launch my 13 weeks when your Zen Mama comes out. And it'll be perfect. Then we'll be up to date and you'll just be getting them every week and we'll be in real time. So it'll be awesome. All right. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.